I saw something, I think I went onto YouTube and it was like trending and it said, watch the first full episode of the new DuckTales. And I was like, oh, wow, you know, like, I kind of want to check that out, even though what little I had seen, I wasn't really that interested, I guess. Um, just because, I don't know, I guess just you know, me. like your childhood being pandered to. Yeah, I mean, I think it was just a little bit of just like, I, had, I just didn't like what I had seen. Um, but I was still curious. I wanted to give it a shot. So I watched it, but kind of half paid attention to it. And then uh, this week we, we're, we're off to a little bit of a late start because like I said, we have a slight audience. And then uh, I told these guys late and like, you know what we should do is we should all watch the first episode and give our thoughts on it. Cause I, did you say it, it was DuckTales? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, just... <laughs> I think so. Yeah, I said DuckTales. Yeah, Duck yeah. yeah. So anyways, uh, the three of us were all pretty big fans of DuckTales, and I figure it's something we'd all have a lot to say. Uh, so yeah, Disney put this whole first episode online for free for everybody. I also read, too, that apparently the day that they did it, I think it was like, I think it was August 6th, it doesn't matter what day it was, but the whole day, apparently, they just played... Like, it took over the channel that it's going to be on, which I think it's on... What is the Disney channel? Like, Disney XD. channel? XD. XD. Um, as I just showed on the screen and yeah. I asked you guys. Um, I believe they literally played it for 24 hours. Uh, over and over again? Is yeah. That, really? I think yeah. it took... Yeah, it took over entirely. I'll, I'll verify that, but... Um, yeah, so I was late to the party and seeing it. So we all just watched it again, fresh, and want to give our take on it. So let's start with the guest over here, Bryant. What did you think of what you saw of the new DuckTales compared to the DuckTales that we grew up with? It's, I don't know, kind of like how you stand. I don't like my childhood being pandered to. So mm -hmm. I'm biased watching it from the get-go. Um, it was entertaining. Do I see myself watching it regularly? Uh, I'll watch it if it's on, but it kept my attention for a while. I don't know if you want to go into like what we did or didn't like. No, that's, I mean, that's what it's for. Go into all of the it. Details. Um, Animation style is, eh, I, I like the old school stuff, like the original animation from DuckTales, Darkwing Duck, Tailspin, Chip and Yells, like that style of animation, versus like this one's a little more like sharp, it almost looks like a computer game or video game to me, as opposed to just regular cartoon style, but that's just, like I said, that's just me being, like, having such fond memories of the original. Um, the voice acting is uh, whatever. The kids are <laughs> yeah. Huey, Dewey, and Louie are kind of just like Bryce was saying, typical over the top Disney voice, just like always yelling, yeah. always yelling, screaming, and overexcited. Um, Scrooge was okay, like your standard, you know, stereotypical Scottish accent. Donald was entertaining. You can kind of understand him at times, and sometimes you can't. And then I didn't like how. I don't know, they kind of twisted some characters, not twisted, but they get a different spin on some characters to me. Launchpad didn't have as much depth, I think. He was just kind of like, oh, this is the buffoon of the group and stuff. Yeah. When Launchpad in the original, he was very, too. he's very like lovable in a sense. Well, first episode. It's first episode, too. yeah. So, so you gotta get that. Yeah, time. it's hard to give it the baseline, but it just, to me, from that first episode, it seems they dumbed down Launchpad a lot. Like he's just some nincompoop in the, in the background. Um, Mrs. Beasley or Bees? I believe it's Beasley. It's Beasley. I'm pretty sure it's Beasley. They made her, like, she was like the lovable grandma type on the original. And in this, it just made her, like, burly, strict um, housekeeper. She seemed like a bitch. I mean, let's just be honest with it. <laughs> yeah. I, that really kind of threw me off, too. Yeah. I mean, not to interject. But... And then Webigail, to me, I, I always thought, like, growing up watching the show, like, Webigail, like, the adorable little sister character type, and they just made her, like, an over-energetic tween in this movie, mm -hmm. like, kind of all over the place and everything, so I get it, they have to do some things different, but, like I said, I'm very biased, because grew up... We're all biased. We're all biased, just love the original, bought it on DVD when it came out, all that stuff, so I was telling Bryce and Rick, like, a fair, I can't give it a fair shake. Um, I'm curious to see if you showed, like, say, a five-year-old, have them watch the original, and have them watch this, and see which one they would gravitate towards more. I'm just curious to see what the result would be with that. I'd be curious, too, but I feel like we'd already know the answer, because, I mean, here's the problem with this. Let's just go down the line, I guess. Um, this, this, to me, just feels like, I'm not that I've seen that many, but what I have seen feels like every other 
cartoon that is on modern day Disney now anyways. You know, like it sort of seems like it has the same look and then especially, yeah, like the voices and stuff. I feel like a lot of the modern day stuff just feels really like, I use this word a lot in the show, but it feels sterile, I guess. Like it just doesn't seem like it has a lot of personality. Um, and that's, that just kind of bothersome to me. Like it doesn't have some of the same charm. Also just to, to uh, from earlier, yes, they did when they premiered this. 24 consecutive hours, they presented the episode starting on Saturday, August 12th on Disney XD. They played the episode. They're really pushing for it. Jeez. Yeah. The series is going to then debut two new episodes on Saturday, September 23rd. Um, yeah. It looks like... I wonder if this is going to kind of be like a Saturday morning thing because it looks like it starts at 7 a.m. It's going to play throughout the day. So, I mean, I guess that's kind of cool. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, like... I don't know. The animation, like, I think that's what it is. Like, it doesn't stand out. It looks like, it honestly looks like it could just be any other Disney cartoon. And this just has, like, a DuckTales skin over it. You know what I mean? The more I look at it, I mean, like, I'm, like, we're looking at it now. Obviously, it's playing in the background. Speaking of which, audience member, how bad is my head blocking the TV or is it not? Okay. So, uh, I mean, like, Scrooge looks pretty good. You know, like, I started thinking, because I was like, actually the second time I watched it when I watched it with you guys today. I just paid attention to it more. I'm wondering if my issue is more with, like, the models of some of the characters. Like, I just don't like the, the, the character models of Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Like, their heads are, like... The style of it? Their, he- boxy. their heads are, like, square. <laughs> but, like, Donald looks Donald's okay. Cool. Scrooge looks Scrooge okay. Looks fine too. But, like, even the colors. Like, doesn't the colors, like, kind of look... A little bland. They're not bright. They don't pop. It looks yeah. like an old-fashioned cartoon. Which like is funny old. because Ducktales is an older old cartoon, old, yeah. but I like on it looks better. But I think the original looks better. The it has so much more very character. Very bright. That's what it is. Like yeah, the muted. colors are very muted. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I need a teleprompter. <laughs> yeah. So the colors are totally like they're just kind of <laughs> muted and stuff. And then yeah, like Scrooge. I think I could get used to. It's still not the same Uncle Scrooge. You're not going to replace that voice. That voice is iconic. Yeah, you know what I mean? Definitely. You're, you will not replace but, it. And I realize a lot of people like David Tennant and all this other stuff. And I'm sure, you know, that you know I didn't even know it was David Tennant until you mentioned it. Yeah, I, it is. is. Doctor, Doctor Who. Who. Oh, okay. Um, so a lot of people loved him. He's still not touching the original voice, though. Oh, not even close. At all. Uh, um, but uh, I'd say it's a nice take. Yeah, it's a, it's a good take. But yeah, I think even I'll even say uh, Launchpad, like his voice, it's different, but I feel like I could get used to it. I could get used to him. It seems like it's the kids that are really, is where it's fucked up. The I kids, totally agree. Yeah, the kids is where it's really messed up. And you, like, they don't even act the same. Like it, it, all these kids seem like they could, like I said already, be from any other Disney cartoon. And that's been the problem, I think, with modern day cartoons. And I really don't think this is just an issue of... It's not our era. Um, yeah, so being resisted here, teleprompter, they, they, the kids do seem more annoying rather Producer. than cute. They seem obnoxious, right? <laughs> yeah. that's, that's how it is. They're totally obnoxious, it's all the, of them. It's the typical over-hyper, over-active kids that you can't get, a, you right. can't get control it's of. It's too modern, in my opinion. But really, oh, yeah. but really, but, but really I mean, that's really what it's supposed for, to for be. For God's like. sakes, the first scene, you have Donald checking his cell phone and unplugging it from right. a charger. It's kind of weird to see something like that. <laughs> You want to punch them in the beak. <laughs> you kind of do. Yeah. Like, but honestly, like, there's a good... See, there's a right way to do modern and a wrong way to do modern. And I think the right way to do modern is... Let's see. Rocco's Modern Life. That movie that's going to be coming out. Like, that's... That show has all the same vibe. And I realize, like, they weren't going to get all the same voice actors. And I understand that with this. That's fine. In fact, if I remember right... I like that shot right there. Right here? Yeah, where he um, walks up to the suit and it yeah, kind of yeah. forms to him. I, in fact, I believe the voice of Scrooge is, uh, actually passed away, so I mean, that would have been impossible. I'll double check that, but I'm pretty sure that's the case. Um, but yeah, it just... We've all kind of seen some modern-day Disney cartoons, right? So you guys see... Part, yeah. You guys see how like the voices of the kids especially just sound like it could be from any cartoon? Do you guys oh, get yeah. that? Yeah, no, no, I totally get that. The, the comedy of this, too, is very quick modern type of right. comedy when like the other like the older versions of it were more um, I don't know the comedy was just there like I don't mean I don't, I don't know how to explain it's it it's like ADD that's the thing they, yes yeah. oh my god it's yeah that's so the right word like, can't... They, they definitely captured the spirit of adventure I'd say which is what, what DuckTales was about but it's just like 
it's a little too fast paced. The dialogue's too fast paced. And like, I feel like, so it's funny. I remember until we watched, cause after this, we all kind of had to cleanse our palate a little bit. I'm like, let me throw on some of the old stuff. All right. Right. Yeah. yeah. Well, and so, well, I just want to get into my thing too before you. Yeah. Rick, can you go ahead? Well, I'm not, I'm, so still, I'm still going. Yeah, I'm not done. I thought you were about to. No, 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 I'm not, no, I'm not switching gears. No, 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 not oh. at all. Started, we, we did that to clean, to clean the palate a little bit. You guys totally threw me off. Oh. Um, but I was going to say while watching this, I was like, what the fuck? The kids all sound the same. But the kids sounded the same. Like, I'm glad we watched that because the kids all sound the same. Uh, the boys, at least, all sound the same in the original, too. Mm-hmm. But there's still something about them where it feels like it just feels different. That, that voice has more character to it, you know? even though the boys do all sound the same. So it's just like, it's just, it's just all wrong, I guess. Um, but yeah, it's we'll throw wrong. <laughs> it's just, it's all, it's, it's all, all wrong. It's all wrong, but I'll throw, I'll throw it to Rick too, to give his take. But before I do that, also, I want to ask just cause Rick is probably of the three of us is more of the comic guy. I didn't know how much, I mean, did you know much about the lore of DuckTales, like the comics and stuff? Like, I, I've I knew learned... I were there, but I, I didn't read them. I've learned recently, because, like, those came first, and, like, even the TV show that we grew up off of doesn't follow the comics, like, yeah. totally. You know, like, there is some stuff, too, about this that, that that's also, you know, like, the game, the Nintendo game, and then also the comics and other stuff. Uh, Scrooge... Where's the color he's wearing here? That red color. But yeah, our cartoon red. is wearing the blue, blue blazer, the blue the thing. red trim, uh, the buttons on it. I think. So with that said, I mean that's my go ahead, Rick. <laughs> um, now I mean they've kind of worked it. You know we love it as kids, and I didn't want to hate this. Like I don't want to not like it. I'm I'm trying to be more positive about like when people make remakes. Like yeah. all right, I'm not gonna get angry. I'm gonna wait to see the final product. I kind of want to. Be positive about this. I mean, even while watching it, if there's something I don't like, I still want to try to be positive about it. And watching it, it's like, I can't it's hard find, to find something, something yeah. to latch on to other than, um, like, Launchpad. I think I can I'll end up liking him. Mm-hmm. You know, the, the, the Huey, Louie, and Dewey are just, they're not annoying, like, annoying, I guess. I want, definitely want to punch them. Webby, Fury too, kid. honestly. <laughs> I hate with you, um, Webby. I mean, yeah, like, that's just not even the same. She was this sweet, kind of innocent but girl. at the same time, I can understand why it's different, because, you know, things have changed. There's, I know what you're trying to do. With, I see the what you're trying to do with Ruby you, yeah. kid, you know, new evolved form of comedy for the new, you know, quick reaction, want something right now, kids. Yeah. Uh, so I can understand it. I can understand why we're not, you know, grabbing onto this as far as wanting to watch it. Mm-hmm. Um, Maybe if the I mean like the animation like it's nice but I don't think it works for this cartoon at all. Um, the older like, animation even if it wasn't like the old like let's say they're they're not even going with the older one they just want to go with the new type of animation. This is not it in my opinion. I don't yeah. I mean at least for me it's not it. You no, know, but like, maybe if the animation was a little bit different. The, the older animation is way nicer though, right? I think we can yeah, yeah, I yeah. think, even though obviously this is more modern and fresh, but yeah, it just... But I'm just saying, like, I don't want to dismiss this animation as far as, like, it just, I completely hate it. I just, or, you know, that they should have gone with the old one. I'm just trying to say they, they could have found a happy medium. Because this feels like complete opposite of what yeah, they... Yeah. What well, they it doesn't did. stand out to me. Other than, like, the story of going on adventures well, and things like that. This animation style you know. is very sharp. Yeah, it's, it's too sharp. It's very opinion. sharp, and that's why I'm curious to see. Like, the original to me has so much charm to it, and I watched this episode. It's too much show. And it doesn't stand out. Well, at it doesn't all. it doesn't stand out? There's not a lot of charm to it, and then I didn't find anything memorable. Like, I'll watch. Maybe that's just me being biased as a kid and stuff, but I can remember so many episodes of Ducktales where, like, oh, this is the one where this happens, or blah blah blah, or they introduce that person. But this is just very like. Yeah, it's like okay, you're introducing yeah. the the brand, so I don't know. Maybe they didn't give a great first impression that for me. What's her name? From Tailspin. I thought that was supposed to be the girl from um, the Goofy movie. That what? I don't think it's supposed to be anybody no. from uh, anybody. Just, I just, just remember it's like Eagle characters. Well, that's kind of what they yeah, yeah what they Eagles like and ducks. Stuff. Yeah. Um, I just, <laughs> I lost my thought. <laughs> uh, it's not okay. So here's the thing. Like yeah, like like Rick said, I don't want to hate on something just because it's a remake, or, or it's being redone or reintroduced. 
I wish I guess I wish it was being more reintroduced. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like it doesn't have to be an exact carbon copy, but why couldn't they? Why couldn't they? Oh, Mike. <laughs> Mike is watching. Mike is here and watching. That shit does. Yes, Mike. That shit does look like poop. <laughs> but why couldn't they have really tried to make it look like the original, but just have it be new episodes? You know what I mean? Like how come yeah. Yeah. whenever they bring this stuff back, it always has to be reinventing the wheel? That's, that's you don't like, need to. Yeah. I mean, like look at like don't reinvent watched, the wheel. Rockos, well, Mother Rockos. Rockos. Yeah, life and it's like, the they same. Just adapted to the new technology that. To modern, yeah, it's probably with the same animation. It's honestly just probably some higher ups decision. Like that has to be. It yeah. has to be because like if you they want to appeal to the younger generation, they want to appeal to the younger generation. Let's understand. And like we're saying, it's the show's very ADD. Like every once in a while, like you're saying, how Launchpad is kind of he had his moments. He's like the only one. Like, yeah. He, he, he made us chuckle a few times, but that's the only that was it. Everything like else. I would probably watch because of him, not yeah. because of them. But uh, David Tennant, apparently now that I know that it's him, like like even before I knew it was him, like I thought it was pretty good. I mean, it wasn't. I thought it was gonna be a lot horrible, but it wasn't bad at all. It feels like it, yeah, it does. I feel like a really bad ripoff. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, I could. I I like the voice. For him, I could actually say I do let like the voice for Scrooge, uh, Scrooge. but it, um, it, it's just it's. I'm not never, saying it's gonna be replaced. It never will. Yeah, of course not. But I mean, at the same time, like I still actually like it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, like I said, the the issue to me seems to be more with the kids, yeah. the, all the more adult characters except for Mrs. Beasley. You know, I, I think I'm okay with. Even, like, there's something, even though we're knocking the animation and stuff, there's something about just, like, looking at this that, like... It's not bad. It makes me happy, because I'm like, oh, especially Scrooge, because Scrooge looks like Scrooge. Yeah. These blocky-ass fucking kids, though, I'm just like, what the hell is that? Um, and, yes, Alan Young, who did the voice of Scrooge originally, did pass away, so I, I didn't want to... I didn't want to say somebody died and they weren't dead. So. <laughs> the guy who also did the voice of... In the head? Sure. Uh, yeah. Or was it the guy... No, you know what? I think he, he uh... Yeah, I believe he did. I'm pretty sure he did. Yeah. I think I remember Hollywood Babylon talking I about I remember it. that too. Uh, but yeah, like, I uh, actually like Scrooge, in my opinion. I mean, that's kind of another thing I like about it. Scrooge was fine. I mean, yeah, it's, no one's well, never going to match the original. No. And you just have to face that fact. Mm-hmm. Uh, but I like what they did. It's like, the animation is not bad, it's just not right for this cartoon, in my opinion. And then, yeah, like, the, like, I think it is true. The colors are just so muted, you know? Like, it's weird looking at yeah. the Especially older cartoon. Scrooge's coat. It's weird looking at the older cartoon, and it looks brighter and even in a lot of ways fresher than this modern cartoon. Um, so, yeah. I don't know. I don't know if I'll watch more. Oh, that's a good point. Very tricks. What's, Cereal. What's the next color? What's next to it? Pranks? Tricks and pranks? Tricks and pranks? I know the serial called pranks. Prongs. <laughs> it's the fancy <laughs> prongs. It's the fancy. What, what are you That's what, the, the European version. That's the French version of what tricks. Is, <laughs> hold on. What is, prongs. What is the producer trying to say? That the colors are like tricks? It's like a bad knockoff. I got oh, you. gotcha. It's yeah. like it doesn't give you the, no. the magic of the original. Yeah. yeah. That's how it feels. It does, but see, like, so, like the adult characters look fine. You got the, the tricks here, and then you got the generic and you got prompts. house brand. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know. I might give a few more episodes a try, and just because it's DuckTales. And this was a Game of Thrones knockoff right here. <laughs> <laughs> just because it's DuckTales, and I'd be curious, but, like, it's just hard to get past the voices. I do like some of the small little Easter eggs. Oh, that was cool. When they um, had the like, construction robots. Did you yeah. See that? What was another yeah. Easter egg? I'm trying to think. Um, when Donald Duck was trying to cover the holes, that was from a classic, oh, yeah, classic. Like Donald Duck mm-hmm. cartoon. Um, I watched a lot of Donald Duck. Uh, what else was there? Yeah. Um, but yeah, it was. It, it, it had its moments, but uh, I'm really happy with the three kids. <laughs> it's unfortunate. The four kids. All four of them. Four kids, yeah. yeah. Um, so yeah, I don't know. That's fine. I was curious. Like I said, maybe I'll check out a few more episodes just to see. Because it's just, it's a familiar property, so it's kind of nice to, to watch, you know? But, yeah. I don't know. 
Um, Let's see, what else did Mike say? The most recent Mickey animated shorts look terrible too, uh, but the cartoons themselves are really funny. It's totally missing the hand. In it. Yeah, it, yeah, it's true. It doesn't have the hand animated charm. Like yeah. it, it's. That's unfortunate. Yeah. The, so. Yeah, we got Rocco. Yeah, we Rocco was yeah. phenomenal. So I'm excited for that. I don't. I wish they could have done something similar with this. Obviously, you know, yeah. they'd still have to use different voices, but it's just so weird how harsh of a change they went with the kids' voices. You know what I mean? Like. Because the, the kids in the original kind of sort of have that Donald touch to like, their voice, they but like they're kids. more clear. Mm-hmm. No, but you know how there's like, you a know, it's almost kind of, there's a little bit of a rasp to it. Yeah. I mean, even Scrooge, like the kids seem like they're obviously related to fucking their uncles, you know? <laughs> they're fucking their uncles. <laughs> I, I said related to them. Come on, let's grow up. Um, so anyways, I think that's all we have to say about DuckTales. Uh, maybe we'll revisit it later. I think it premieres in September. I know it premieres in September because uh, I said it earlier. <laughs> but yeah. Anyways, DuckTales. Ooh. <laughs> DuckTales. Ooh. 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 Question mark? Yeah, I'm just not sure. 